Hello friends, uh, this is John Henry Sheridan and here is my Thoughtful Pause offering for you tonight. Loving, got notes here, loving self-reflection equals self-improvement. Loving self-reflection equals self-improvement. I'll keep this one brief. Do you remember the last time scathing self-criticism brought you tears of joy? Remember the last time uh, silently berating yourself um, brought you bubbles of giddy laughter? <laughs> um, you can see where I'm going. Loving self-reflection. Loving self-reflection means to me, You know, what's going on with me? How do I feel? How do I really feel? Um, where am I stuck? Where am I struggling? What are my pain points? Um, where do I feel I'm growing, expanding, improving, if anywhere? And uh, refraining from setting new goals or anything like that. Just reflecting lovingly, saying this is who I am. And then loving that person or approaching that, even that question, who are you, where are you at, with love. And no matter where you're at, that I'm bringing love to the question, to myself. And just look at myself with love. What does love mean? It means, to me, it means uh, unconditional acceptance. And forgiveness, because life is, I won't curse, life is effing tough, man. It can be cruel and can seem very unfair. So that I, I even decide to keep on participating at all it deserves a medal sometimes. And that applies to all of us, I think. So loving self-reflection leads to self-improvement. Maybe we're not making any particular gains today numerically or uh, in a, an external way, but that we're accepting ourselves and reflecting and giving time to ourselves is a gain. At the very least, we're not making a mess, you know, and causing more chaos in the world from acting in a place that's not loving to ourselves. When we're not loving with ourselves, it's not likely we're going to create true value in the world if we're like mad at ourselves and doing stuff. That's my opinion. That's my take. That's my offering. You don't have to believe it, um, of course. Um, but I offer it to you for thought. Loving, self-reflection equals self-improvement. So when we make time to lovingly self-reflect, we are improving ourselves and therefore improving the world. Because guess what? The world could definitely use more love. It's my humble opinion. All right. So love yourself because that you could do. And if you have a hard time loving yourself, like yourself. And if that's hard, at least come up with something you do well. Compliment yourself. We all deserve love. So let's not be stingy with giving it to ourselves. All right, that's my offering today. I love you guys. Yeah, yeah, deal with it. I love you, okay?